Y'all, I got a story to tell. And the best place to do it is at dinner. I'll be I'm sorry if it's a little dark, guys. The lighting, you know, I'm dark skin, so the lighting has to be like real bright. We need to look a little brighter, but we gonna work with what we are going to work with. First and foremost, guys, I'm here eating at um my favorite favorite restaurant in the whole wide world. Oh, thank you. Crab house on my seat. But um I'm here for a quick story time. Yeah. I just have to tell y'all this, like, and I swear to God. Don't mind my hair by the way. It's gonna get done. I don't know when, but it'll get done. Um y'all, this happened at like 12 in the morning. This well, all right, it was like eleven. And little old me decided to walk to the store, right? So you know I walk to the store, get what I need to get, and I'm walking back home now. I left my phone home and I never leave my phone home. Never. No matter no matter how close the store is or any of that. I never leave my phone home. But some for some reason I had left my phone home, y'all. Bruh. I'm walking back from the store, right? I hear like a car race like cars racing like going crazy so i stopped because i'm scared thank god i stopped thank thank god i stopped the car goes right in front of me because i'm right about to cross the street the car i'm right here here's the car like going around me bro oh my god the cops chasing him so i'm nosy y'all know me y'all know so she live Slow tree leg is nosy as hell. Um, I'm walking slow because he turned back towards the way I just walked from, which is down the block. So I'm walking slowly. I want to see what's going to happen. Boy, first of all, the cops, yo, New York cops are terrible. Running from them is probably the easiest thing to do. Y'all, mm, this food is so good, y'all. So, he gets down the block and hops out the car. Bro, he hopped out the whip and booked it. Yo, he was running so fast, I swear to God. How he caught, he, he ran so fast, he caught up to where I was and passed me. Yo, he was out running. Once I started seeing him running, I slowed down, cause I'm just like, I don't know. If he gonna try to kill me because I'm a witness or whatever. So I wanted to see where he was going. Ah, I'm going to Or whatever. You know, I don't know what he did. I do not know what that man did. So I slowed down. I was not with nothing. You would think I would speed up, but no, you have to be careful. Uh uh. I need to know where you're running. You know, I know my neighborhood very well, so I know like where to run, whatever, whatever. So, um,. I'm walking slow. He's running. He finally get close to me. I swear. God is my witness. If I'm lying, I'm dying. This man left his car with the police down the block. And they gave up. Mind you, he ran straight. He didn't make any cut, no turns, no nowhere. It's only like 1130 at night. He just ran straight. So they could have caught him. All they had to do is get back in the car and go come straight down the block. They must have been tired that night. They really didn't want to catch him. But anyway, um, 
clap and you should just in case you do want to something Okay, thank you. So um yeah he he catches up to like where I am. So at this point he don't even look like no shooter type of guy. He don't look like he's armed or anything like that. He don't look like then again you never know, but at that point that's what I was thinking in my head. I'm like he ain't no danger to me. I'm not you know, I don't I don't care. So I'm like, yo, they are right down the block. You need to run a little faster. I was like, you're running too slow. If we both can see the cops, you are running too slow, buddy. What you doing? He's like, man, I left my car. Yo, this man, this man put the keys into his building door and went in the house. Bro, I can't make it up. I'm telling him to run fast to get away from the police. This man went inside his crib. All right, fuck that car. <laughs> yeah. Funniest thing ever, y'all. He went into his house and just went upstairs. And I wasn't gonna tell him either. If they would've caught up to me, I won't say I don't know that man. I don't know where he went. I was talking to myself. I, I don't play like that. My boy was good. Hey, if you see this, you is fine, by the way. And he lived right around the corner from me. I ain't gonna say where he lived at, but he lived real close by. Hey, if you see this? Mm -hmm. He did fine too. Uh -huh. I ain't gonna incriminate him. I don't believe in that. But, um, I was ready to testify. He didn't do nothing. That man did not, he didn't do nothing. They was bothering that black, handsome man. He was just minding his business. And the cops was just bothering him. That's, that's what I would have told the, um, the judge. Mm -hmm. Jail time for what? Gun? No, I didn't see a gun. I really didn't see a gun, but it had they would have said, oh, there was a gun. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But y'all, that was the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. Like, to see that in person is crazy. Money gloves. That was the funniest thing, y'all, I've ever seen in the 29 years that I've been on this earth. <laughs> How you run from the cops and make it home? <laughs> They didn't even want to really catch him for real, for real. Like, they didn't care. Their problem is that work for like 15 hours. I was like, you know what? Go do what you do. We don't care. <laughs> but he left the car, though. That's what's crazy. My man left his car. If that wasn't his car, he's good. But you don't have to explain that to whoever the car, like whoever's the car owner of that car. You have to explain. But man, sending prayers to um homeboy. Uh, I know once they run your license plate, if that is your car, they came to your crib. But you ain't have to open the door or nothing, so it not really matter. But still, I'm sending prayers to you, homeboy. You is fine. I hope you see this. I know. I can be your ride or die. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna die, but I'll ride. Mm hmm. That time. Nope. I'm just playing, y'all. I'm just playing. But he looks fine for a girl. Like, oh, I'm going. He looks like a king. I was just like, whoa, what you done did? What did, what did they do to you? <laughs> At this point, it was what did they do to him? He ain't do nothing. But. That's the end of my little mukbang story time. Mm. I forgot what you call this, but it tastes good. You guys know what this is again? I forgot what it is, what it's called. Uh, um, not lo mein. Yeah, lo mein. Really good. 
But y'all, that was the end of my little story time. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you hit that like button, that subscribe button, comment down below. Let me know. Y'all wanna hear some more crazy stories? Cause I got like some real crazy stuff that I've seen. Like way worse than that. That's not nothing. <laughs> That's nothing, nothing, even compared to anything that I've seen in my life. Nothing, nothing, you, you know what I mean, you know what I mean, but guys, comment down below if you guys want some more stories from me, because I, I have some stories that I'm ready to tell, I'm ready to talk, y'all. If you guys are willing to listen, I'm ready to talk. So comment down below and you guys have a great day.